Okay, so, uh, hello. I haven't made a video in a while and I didn't really know what video I should be making. So I just thought, hey, maybe I could just show you all of the sketchbooks I worked on throughout 2023. Yeah, that's what this video is gonna be about. But as it's gonna be a lot of sketchbooks, Likely a lot of it is gonna be cut out, so we'll see. Okay, <laughs> I guess let me go and grab the sketchbooks. Oh my god, it's just so heavy. Oh my god. Okay. Oh. So. Oh my god, I don't even think the camera could get all of it. But this is literally all of my sketchbooks I've done throughout 2023. And a bit into, as you can see, a bit into 2022 as well, because I jump around sketchbooks a lot. Like this one. August 2022 to August 23. But at the same time, November 15, 2022 to March 6, 2023. Hold on, let me see if I can zoom out a bit. That's about as much as I can zoom out, sadly. Let's see all the dates. This one is February 2023 to October 2023. Don't know if you can see that. This is a giant sketchbook. Oh, you can see it like this. November 14, 2022 to March 20, 2023. March 20, 2023 to April 19, 2023. Yeah, I see, I jump around between many, many sketchbooks. April 18, 2023 to July 15, 2023. A lot of it is during summer when I was the most free. July 26, 2023 to October 25, 2023. And October 25, 2023 to January 28, 2024. And I should probably start from the earliest, so... Oh, they're so out of order. It's gonna be hard to try and figure out. The earliest is probably this one. Let me move. Oh my god, I have to somehow move all the other sketchbooks away. Okay. Okay, so starting with this one, 110 pages. Of course, I don't even know if you can see it clearly on camera. I wonder. You actually increase the ISO, hold up. Menu. Well, I just ended up bringing in another light to hopefully make it more visible. Oh my god, they're all so bad. So many issues with anatomy. Also, I have some like school assi art assignments on here. Uh, Toho Flander, I believe. I end up drawing her a lot. Flander, Romelia, and Miku. I think I'm just I draw the most as like my base whenever I'm just doodling. I mean, like I said, literally right here again. Lots of empty pages. The amount of empty pages I end up having throughout the sketchbooks later on become less and less. Cause I just like filling them up more. Cause save money because of how expensive sketchbooks are, but also save space because the more sketchbooks like look at all this waste of space. The more sketchbooks, the more space I'll need to store them, unfortunately. Okay. Oh god, I can't feel. 
font face for a uh, typeface class I had. I believe I should move later on because this is still 2022, a lot of these. Okay. I believe this is starting with 2023. So this is for a class for cartoon drawings. So you can see a bunch of random, car more cartoony style. And more studies. I'm just gonna. I'm gonna talk a bit and just just rec quietly flip through because, yeah, there's a lot to get to. I still have six other sketchbooks I have to go through. Oh my god, so many wasted pages. Look at this. Anatomy study. This drawing. More anatomy. I really love just doing blocky anatomy studies. It's very very fun to do and very relaxing because it's just something I can somewhat shut my brain off but at the same not exactly like, and just good practice especially for perspective drawing for people oh my god the face is so off on this quite a lot just gonna speed through maybe you could just pause but it's quite a lot, so I'm just gonna go as much as possible. Okay, it's this. My teacher gave like transfer paper to use to draw over original like drawings to check variation. For example, like eyes, some extra trinkets and whatnot. So I should probably do that more often as practice using transfer paper to do edits on traditional drawings. Like, go back to old drawings and draw over using transfer paper to see how it changes it. Maybe that would be a video idea. I don't know. Single eyelash, okay. So many anatomy issues, oh my god. 20, beginning of 2023. Kamen, no, not Kamen Rider. Is it? I don't remember. Gundam. Where if any of this is visible on camera? I hope so. More blank pages. Oh my god, this is just. I guess I missed these pages. There's two whole pages that are just empty. Three whole pages are just empty. My god. Uh, and then these are some drawings from classmates. Because we just decided to do a sketchbook share. That's just the first sketchbook. And there's quite a like, lot of pages that were just straight up empty. But later on, they could become more and more filled. On to the next sketchbook. This is this one. November, after, November 15, 2022 to March 6, 2023. So this is 70 pages. Immediately starting off with studies. Uh, different objects. I think I should zoom in a bit for this one because it's much smaller. Hold up. Is this in focus? I'm not sure. More studies. Should I even bother to me in? Probably not. I right, maybe should have gone with autofocus. Ah well. Oh, this is a good post, this one, right here. Probably drew it from a reference, but it's pretty good. 
Oh god. Okay, these are so bad. Look at these attempt at realistic face drawings. Hold on, let me grab my current sketchbook to show you the difference between 2023. Actually, is this 2023 or 2022? I don't know if we've reached 2023 yet. But basically, end of 2022, early 2023. This is by realistic face drawings. Let me grab my current sketchbook. I think it's in this one, the October 25th, 23 to January 28, 2024 one, actually. It's not particularly good, but let's see. They are clearly much more stylized side by side. Also, I actually hit my camera. Whoops! But this is beginning of this year, 2024. And beginning of last year. We got this one and these. Not super good still with anatomy, but much, much better. So it's a bit more stylized, I would say. So I guess this is even more stylized. Anyway, going back to this sketchbook we're focusing on. More studies. This is so bad. I don't even remember what half of these are. Just random head drawings. Lots of anime style. Dirty sketchbook. Probably from when I was eating and drawing at the same time. Okay, this is where I first got alcohol markers. So I really want to try using alcohol markers. Not that good. I do not understand how to use alcohol markers. And also I bought the cheap kind as well. So maybe that's the reason, but I think it's more so just cause I don't know how to use alcohol markers. Could be much better. And you can see how much bleeding through the pages there was. I see so many atom ah, how do you say it? Atomical? I cannot say it. Anatomy. Anatomical. There we go. Oh my god, I left the bleeding piece here. Here as well, but I guess that's more because of the bleeding. You know, I was just about to say that you can immediately see I have started to fill up the pages more. But then we come to a very, very blank page. So, there goes that. Okay, this is good. Super loose, I should do more of these. Draw more with just straight pen, like this. This is pretty good. Me attempting to use colored pencil. Just straight on drawing. Look at this tiny ass head. Ah, <laughs> oh, so painful. Oh my god. Mm. Very, very generic art style I had. Like the most generic, like, big boy anime style I feel like. 
You can see they me like experimenting with face shapes here. I quite like this one. And this one down here. I don't know if you can see it. This one and oh, this one down here. Don't know if you can see it clearly. Very bad YouTuber. Huh. I started using more like color pencil, maybe red and blue, as underdrawing as I work more with the straight up ink. Which then later on I'll go back to using just normal pencil and occasional color pencil. And that's yeah, this sketchbook. We're done with two. To this one. When is this one? February 2023 to October 25, 2023. So, quite a long time. Basically, almost an entire year. How could I didn't draw as much on this one? Immediately, you can see I start with a painting. I think this is when I bought gouache and wanted to try learning gouache, but I really quickly gave up, as you can see. bit more gouache attempt here and then just let the rest blank because I think I saw I was gonna go back and do more gouache practice but I just never did it in the end. This is so bad. Uh, these are all so bad. Uh, more studies, eye studies and Head studies. I need to do more of these. I need to do more studies. I stopped doing this kind of studies, which is bad. Because it's honestly very helpful. I keep smacking the sketchbook. Okay, this is studies of just artists. You can see here, I copied artists and basically wrote like some things I noticed. And I also put the artist I study from. I don't know if you can see it clearly. But the, I also wrote down the artists I study from. So you see a couple of, I think not a couple, quite a bit of like artist copies to better understand what they do. And I recommend that. Just like copying artists you like. Obviously not like trace, but just copy from blank. What am I saying? <laughs> and then we see, ah yes, the anime drawing that I did in a video for I Pull I Draw. Wow, finally working color. I really like them. This one turned out so well. Oh my God, it's insane. This one never ended up completing. I don't think I'll complete this actually. Actually, maybe. Maybe I'll do the transfer paper on top and ink on that to see how it'll look. Oh. This one. Himeko. I was gonna do her from Star Rail and Impact, like side by side, but I guess I just never finished it. And that's a very common thing, I just never finish stuff. The Hanacha art study, unfortunately I instantly lost the inking ability I learned from this practice. Probably because I wasn't consistent enough. More style studies. This is from an art book I have. Blank, wow. Oh my. What am I doing? So many blank pages. Okay, line practice. As you see, my sketchbook is basically filled with the most random of random things. Like this page. I don't even know if you can see it clearly. It's filled with like a bunch of random drawings. And this is more focused. 
So yeah, because I think we plan on showing it's just the most random collection of studies, drawings, doodles, practices. Ah uh, yes, good old middle finger here. Why am I too strong? Let's see if I can slightly decrease it. I think that'll just a bit better, more diffused. Will I edit this? Or should I just upload this as pure blank? Probably edit the coloring and lighting a bit, but other than that, it's probably just gonna go up raw. Maybe I'll add some music so you just don't have to just listen to my disgusting voice. Because it's quite a bit. Uh, more cell study. Oh, I forgot this, the artist. It might be Shiku, because that's what I wrote there. But this was an honestly very, very fun study practice. Loom study practice that I never completed. The beanbag practice. I don't know actually how much it actually helped me, but I like doing them because they're very fun and relaxing. Pinterest art drawings, you know? The ones that everybody ends up doing. I think do more of these. Just straight up ink, no underdrawing to help force me to learn anatomy better. This one turned out pretty good. I think this was used drawn using a brush pen, which I'm amazed turned out this well. Some more anatomy. Head studies. I need to add hair to these head studies. Or at least the indication of hair because it looks so weird without hair just bald oh, more studies hand studies none of these ever stuck I'm still so bad at hand studies I started doing hand studies again recently because not good Kind of sad despite how many hand studies I've done. In fact, looking at these, I think I actually got worse at drawing hands compared to how I used to. Like these look pretty good compared to how I draw them now, which is honestly very depressing. Oh my god, all my pens are to the side here, so I keep knocking into them. Uh, the box and it's under rotation challenge. I never ended up finishing this because I got bored part way through. It's decent. I should have used darker pencils to make the black parts even blacker. Like the entire wall here I believe is black. The shadows need to be darker as well. I should have used like some darker pencils maybe to have more variation in tones. The tones are values. I think it's values actually. This one was turning out decent. That's it. Wow, surprisingly nothing I have to cut out or censor. <laughs> I was actually worried I would have to maybe censor some because I just drew I drew quite a bit of nude studies as well so I was worried I maybe have to censor them but luckily no Okay, so this one's from November 14, 2022 to March 20, 2023 So, you saw the art was a bit later so uh, back to bad again so This is going to be more annoying to show I guess I'll just flip this on like this and hopefully it doesn't push the tripod away. A couple of illustration practices. Or not practices, just of illustrations. Actually, this is all 2022. This was an attempt at just empty mind drawing. Unfortunately, I lost the ability to do this because I just been doing studies, 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 studies so much that 
It's actually become hard for me to just draw like this just straight on without any reference material. So uh, make sure to have a good balance of drawing from imagination and drawing from reference. Don't be like me. What the hell is this? Ah, uh, the new size as I was saying. What? This sketchbook seems to be many studies actually. Good studies? No. But I guess study is nonetheless. I also can even see the lower part, but it doesn't really matter. It's just like the last like inch of the sketchbook outside of the frame. So should be fine. Let me be an idiot and be completely wrong. Yeah, this is mi this sketchbook I think is majority just study, 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 study. Let me just start flipping through this even faster, I guess. You can pause the video if you want to see a specific page, I guess. I need to write down like things I realize. I need to practice more. Sorry, I got too close to the mic there. God, imagine if the mic's not running. Oh dear god. That means I have to do a complete voiceover of everything. Oh my god. That would be so painful. You studies. I just realized you can't see anything on this side of the sketchbook. But it's fine. It's not really a lot of stuff of interest there. It's basically just what you see here, plus more on that side of the paper. Oh wow. When is this? 2023, January 29. Okay, that's old. Literally over a year old of that one. Yeah, looking at this, I'm like, I see Gary Finn improved, but maybe not. I'm not even sure anymore looking at these. Like, the look at some of these drawings, I'm like, oh, I don't think I could draw them now anymore. But it's very sad. Oh, the one line drawing challenge. Is it a challenge? I think it's just a practice. I think it's really a challenge. I mean, okay, it is a challenge because it's kind of difficult, but it's also more of a study for contour. Wow, look at me using all these fancy art words. Oh, it's so flipping again. This side. We are already half. Is it been half an hour? Maybe I should quickly go through the other sketchbooks to see if there's anything extra. I just realized a lot of these sketchbooks, well, yeah, three of them are all like this. Which can make flipping through them so painful. Yeah, the last four sketchbooks are all like this. We're just gonna make flipping through them incredibly painful. So I guess 
I'll show you the ones on this side if it's uh, interest. Like I guess this one. I believe I forgot this is called a Loomis or Riley method for head study. God, why did we continue flipping back and forth like this? What? Stay up, paper. Thank you. The distortion on this video is probably insane from the perspective it's recording from. Oh hey, is that Bay? I think it's an art study as well. From, is it Mika Picasso? I believe so, this one. Mika Picasso, yep, style study. March 25th, 2023. More Mika Picasso style study. So hair study. Eye studies. You see a lot of my sketchbook is majority of the studies. I don't know what this page is. God, why did you draw so much? Draw less me, please. So much work. This, I believe, I was going through a bunch of pictures of artworks done by artists I like and trying to do small... I forgot what the correct word is, but smaller drawings to better understand the composition. Feet! Oh my god! Why am I showing this? Okay, yeah, this is even more as you can see here. Just a lot of art work, like mini portraits to understand the composition. And yeah, all these are like from artists I really like and composition I really enjoy. So I don't think I really captured some of them. Oh, when did I stop recording? I don't know. Camera turned off because it reached the limit. Yeah, as I was saying, hopefully I'm not repeating, but these are just snapshots of artworks I like, but some of them I don't think I captured the energy or composition well enough, like these two. These feel like normal portrait drawings. Going back. So much, holy crap. I need to start just working straight up with ink more to better practice. Like force me to be conservative with my strokes. Oh yeah, like this. I should do this more as well. Just breaking down animals into geometric shapes to help understand how to better draw them. A lot of these practices I have not done recently, which I should, because they're very helpful. Like all of these, just straight up with ink. This one, I believe, is just trying to draw only using the outline and trying to make it look good. Which <laughs> looks very funny. And, I mean, it looks cool. Also very interesting. Oh my God, look at all these eye studies for lighting and setting the form of the eye. No wonder my art skills have gotten worse. I've not been doing any of these recently. Oh, hey, one Musume. Oh, yeah, this. I am studying anatomy through the Bridgman book. So I'm actually like numbering for me to better understand. And this is what I basically did to study the Bridgman books. 
some like kind of one line studies, contour studies, but mainly just trying to be as fast and loose as possible. God, why do I draw so much? I cannot tell you what this page is. It just looks like a jumbo mess to me. Uh, back to the studies, practices. I might skip a couple of the sketchbooks. If there's not a lot of importance in it. It's just some more composition studies from art books of Japanese screen prints, I believe. Which was very fun. Like, this one is pretty educational because you can clearly see the composition choices done by the artist to make the entire scene. I might just quickly... I might just skip any pages that seem redundant. Just to get through things faster. Oh yeah, this is interesting. This is also... This one I did do underdrawing with the red pencil where some parts are still showing. And to try to go in with, I believe, a dip pen and also a brush. And that's, yeah, it for this one. Okay, so these three left. I'm thinking of just skipping this sketchbook, April 18, 2023 to July 15, 2023, because it's a bit redundant with a bunch of the other sketchbooks in terms of the period I drew them and the content is basically all the exact same as the other sketchbook. So I'm gonna not go through this sketchbook to save some time. And these two sketchbooks left. This one. October 25th, 2023 to January 28th, 2024. Which I'm not gonna do right now, I'm gonna do this one first. And of course I'm just gonna skip a bunch of pages that I feel are redundant. Luckily the first page is not. It's a study of spider and anatomy. Cause I thought maybe it would be good to branch out a bit. And I thought, Maybe insects, cause they're pretty cool to draw. And they have very really defined shapes, so it makes it easy to break down compared to animals. A lot more just studies. Oh, this is fun. My attempt at drawing vehicles which it's all right. I believe I should pay more attention to where I place the shadows. Cause I believe I could put, could have put more shadows in, and much more cleanly in these two. And probably could have gone over with alcohol markers to add another layer of value to the drawing. And I don't know if you can see it, but there's also bicycles on the bottom. And for some reason, I did like a couple pages of vehicle practice. We have trucks here, and then more trucks and plane. You can see here, I actually use alcohol markers as practice for yeah, another like layer to the entire drawings. More study here. Actual things this time but it's very, very simplified. I cut out like a lot of like the details of the vehicle cause I didn't know how to draw them well. So I just cut them out. Some, I believe Pinterest study or copy, however you want to call it. More so here.
even more Pinterest studies. Like quite a bit of Pinterest study. Like, look at this. Even more Pinterest drawings. I haven't done any recently though. Some practice on environment drawing. That's I think also images from Pinterest. Lots of Pinterest. Lots and lots of Pinterest. The artist's best friend for reference. But then again, everybody uses those photos, so I don't know how original those drawings will be. Love a sword vein. Okay, so for this one, I actually tried doing a bunch of pre drawings beforehand. Ah! Well, you can ignore that. But yeah, I did a lot of pre drawings actually before I started doing the ink one. For some odd reason, I chose the most boring one, if I'm gonna be honest. It's looking back at it now. This one, this one, and this one. These three all have very interesting compositions which could be further built upon. This one, maybe zoom out a bit more. This one, yeah, this one definitely zoom out more so you can get the entire body in it rather than like cutting out the legs. This one, I feel like if you turn the camera a bit more towards an angle like this, it would help this one. But yeah, for some reason, just the most boring one to do. I don't know why. After doing all of those like composition planning, very dumb with me. I don't know why I'm flipping like this. More Pinterest studies. Actually no, these are all original. Never mind, these are not Pinterest. These are all like practice the street drawing from my mind. Which I think they're pretty good. This one is Pinterest study, so. This is Suisse. Which I never finished and I'm glad I didn't. The line work is so bad. But actually, I might also use transfer paper and draw over this. Let me figure out if I have transfer paper so I should have some chilling around, but I'm not sure. Oh, hey, bae. And then green. I'm very proud of this drawing. Could do better with using more blacks. Like more solid areas of just straight black. I'm too afraid of just using straight blacks. That's my issue. I need to be braver. Just put large blocks of black into... Okay, you know. You know you want to be seen. But yeah, I need to use practice more with just straight up blacks. Because they really add a lot to an illustration. It's an ink illustration, which I am too afraid to do. More Bay. More Ina. I believe this is. This is. Oh, this is from a video game. I forgot the name. It's from the Tales series, I believe. More practice that I never end up doing, where you. Just make a bunch of blobs with alcohol marker or paint or watercolor, whatever you like. And just try to draw an actual ink illustration over it. I feel I'm very poorly explaining these. So this sketchbook is surprisingly way more interesting than the past few because it's actual stuff that's not just studies. Like look, more Toho. More Toho! Oh my god, more Toho! Way more interesting stuff to look at. God, the lighting sucks though. I will admit that my room has like zero lighting. I barely got any lamps or lights around. Maybe I should go buy some for YouTube. I don't know. 
I also need some just in general for taking better pictures. Oh my god, please. Yeah, taking better pictures of my artworks. This is so bad. It's so painful looking back at these. Oh my god, damn. I basically drew nothing good. I think it's an original character which I just never ended up finishing. It's kind of creepy. Just seeing the face like this. Blank page, wow. Wow, what the hell? Oh yeah, that's right. For some reason, I ended up forgetting to work out all these pages. So I... And then, I proceeded to instantly jump to... This is the last page to draw stuff. I don't know why. This is... I believe for character design. This is an original character. Me trying to come up with a design for them. I end up sticking, not using the long hair, sticking with the more exploded looking hair. I don't know if you can see it clearly. Oh well. Yeah. Put that back. And oh my god, we're at the last sketchbook, thank god! Finally! Ugh. Why did I draw so much? And this sketchbook, I think it's mainly pencil drawings. Pencil and charcoal. So my hands can get very dirty going through this sketchbook. This is alright. Lacks so much form, looks so flat though. Okay, this looks even flatter, so there's that. Okay, maybe I should just skip through some of these. Anything interesting in here? Looks like a no. Love these just studies upon studies upon studies. Oh god, I'm definitely not gonna show you guys that. I see. Screw it. Look how the Rembrandt study was pencil. And charcoal. It's so bad. I think it's Megumi. That never just you know finishing for some reason. I have lots of unfinished drawings. That's my norm. Starting a drawing but never finishing it because I don't like how it turns out, so I just abandoned it. Abandonment issues my drawing, so god. It's probably not good. I should just finish them even if I despise them. Just for the practice. Oh, that's pretty good. I like this one a lot, the way the clothes just go out. Also from Pinterest, I believe. Everything's from Pinterest, of course. More face practice. More face practice. More face and a mixture of other stuff. This is pretty good. This is, I believe, from a website. I forgot which website this was. No, this is not. This is from YouTube. Master Academy, was it? And these turned out very well, actually. I'm amazed. I don't think I can even do this now. As I said, a lot of my art skills have disappeared. Sadly. Which is very, very depressing. Oh, tissue. Study. A lot of my sketchbook stuff is just studies upon studies. So it's Oh god. Hopefully I won't get it. Hopefully YouTube won't strike me for uh, showing you that. It's for educational purposes, so hope not. 
I'm just flipping very quickly. I don't know how well it's even capturing these. I mean, also, I, you should have noticed, even though it's not visible, but yeah, front and back are all being completely filled with these drawings, which both amazes me and terrifies me the amount I draw. Oh my god, look, it's the last stretch. We're almost done. I can finally escape this. I need so much work with my ink drawings. Jesus. Please stay down. Paper. Okay. God dang it. Alright, fine. Oh hey, this is pretty good. Scratch that, the anatomy sucks on these. The legs on this one is way, way, way too long. Well, the head on this one is way, way, way too big, and the legs are too short. And the head on this one is too small. The dichotomy of these two... <laughs> it's so funny. Should be like swap. Maybe then it'll work. Paper, please just stay up. No, just stay up. We're almost done. Please, I beg of you. You're almost free. Almost free from looking at all my random artworks. No! You know, I guess I'll just. Animal studies. I need to do more animal studies. I'm so bad at animals. More blocks. Very empty page. Just one single girl. Oh yeah. A bit of mechanical drawing studies. Like this. Because I got into building Gunpla recently, so I've been using them every now and then for drawing practice and understanding mechanical forms. Which is very tough to do. <laughs> it's so tough, it's such a struggle. God, this is gonna be like a one hour video of just absolute nonsense. <laughs> Oh my god, it's the last few. Oh yes, the face studies. This one feels very cartoony. Paper, please. This one feels very, very cartoony. I'm trying to show you guys. I don't know how clear you can see. <laughs> very like cartoony style proper. The face drawings I showed you earlier. Come on. Paper. Let me grab hold. Yeah. Oh my god, we reached the end. We completed all my sketchbooks. Fuck this to now. Well, kinda now. Oh, that took so long. Look at all of them together. Look at all of them together. All of these sketchbooks. All of them. Ah. Look at all of these guys. Yeah, that's pretty much all the all the sketchbooks and drawings I've done throughout 
2023. Majority of them, not actual full illustrations. Just all study, 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 studies. Was I improved from them? I don't think so. Maybe a bit. But yeah. I think it's because mainly I focused too much on... I was mindlessly doing those studies without like actually paying attention to why they are the ways they are. So I need to be more conscious, like conscious studies rather than like mindless studies when I do future like practices and whatnot. So, well, hopefully this year as well, I'll draw just as much or maybe even more than I did last year. That's the hope. And hopefully I'll actually improve or have very visible improvement. But who knows? Yeah, that's all. Thanks for watching this probably very boring, very unedited, and very long video. <laughs> See you guys!